Hello and welcome to Who Dares Rolls TV. I am your host, Mike B, and here we are again with another thrilling instalment of um, whatever the hell this is. Um, so, stuff that's been going on this week. It's uh, what is well. Let's start right off the gate. Kickstarter. Let's let's dive into Kickstarter. <laughs> Joyous of Kickstarter. Um, Dungeon Horde. Okay. So, if you've not followed this, there was a Kickstarter project called Dungeon Horde that was being. Um, uh, put out by a uh, white, I can't remember the name of the company. Okay, essentially, this complete dickhead took an existing game off Game Crafter called Dungeon Horde, copied and pasted pretty much the entire contents of that project, um, and then some from previous other Kickstarters and picked and chose that, combined this together, put it onto Kickstarter with the attempt to fund the game. Um, clearly that didn't go well, um, <laughs> he was caught out and um, he was barely able to string a sentence together in regards to it. Clearly English isn't his first language or just maybe clearly he's just away with the fairies. Um, so that was that was crash and burn. Kickstarter cancelled that through the hugely fantastic, you know, quality control. They worked out eventually it was a scam. Um, and he subsequently then did Christ is Born as another game, which again, he's taken from Gamecraft, I believe. Um, uh, just... <laughs> so that's happened. Um, that other one has been cancelled as well. Um, I think that was cancelled by Kickstarter. He cancelled the first one in some intelligible nonsense on there. I mean... <sighs> Words fail me. Um, so there was that, which was uh, was interesting. Um, what a twat. Uh, so what else have we got going on? Super Gnomes is uh, Super Gnomes is on Kickstarter at the moment. It is funded, but it could always have some more funding. That can never hurt. Uh, we reviewed it literally this week. The other day, a review went out. Um, it is it's for your, if you want to review it, I will have it following this. There'll be a button to click at the end of this video about that. Um, but it's on there. There's a bunch of other reviews as well as mine. Other reviews are available. Um, and uh, yeah, it's a really good dice chucking, really fun little game. Um, so that's out there. That's that's there. That's on Kickstarter as well. We're doing a Kickstarter thing. Um, what else is coming out? Uh, then there is uh, the Gothic game, Damnation. Damnation, the Gothic game. I don't know. One of those ways around. That's coming to kickstart in a couple of weeks' time. It is a roll and move with player elimination, um, but it's kind of really cool looking. I did a preview of it ooh, a couple of weeks back. Um, so we'll be coming to a, like a preview review thing of it soon. It's it's just a gorgeous looking thing. Um, so that's coming out very soon. Especially Halloween is nearly upon us, which you know Halloween's coming. We want to play some scary games, which I'll, I'll quickly tease now. Actually, we're going to be doing a top ten horror games for Halloween evening. That's coming up. So there you go. There's a there's another tease for you. Well, we're on Kickstarter, uh, cool mini or not, have uh, put out Zombie Side Second Edition. You know. Um, so that's nice, uh, which is essentially Zombicide with new miniatures uh, and a mildly updated rulebook with some campaign plays, all the stuff that people kind of wanted a bit. Lovely. Uh, $140 buy-in pretty much because you're going to want the expansion. I'm sure some add-ons have been added onto it. I'm personally at the point of kind of almost of a fuck you to call me or not, to be honest with you. Um, they After sales service is shocking uh, in regards to your back this and then they won't respond to the backers everything's running late i mean i think the last three or four projects are all kind of behind or late or most of them are um, or they've not even told people um so yeah i i you know call me you need to seriously sort it out because the days of them being a well i say the days of them being a whack a kickstarter and people throw money at them um people are still doing it uh, i won't be throwing money at kick call me for a while if at all again to be honest with you because the after sales service is shocking um, they don't just you're, you're in black void once that project is funded you will hear nothing more from them um, uh, until they maybe eventually go past the release date window and then they tell you they're, they're delayed so you know I, I really dig some cool mini games uh, you know Blood Rage is a cracking game uh, Arcadia Crest really enjoyed that uh, Godfather is really good um, I think me in the days of cool mini and their kickstars are kind of done really um, at this point unless they sort it out ah, there we go i have a platform to rant on i'm ranting but there we go it's on there if you want to have a look at it it looks kind of cool but you know i've i've reached the point where you're looking at a hundred dollars plus 
they're going to have add-ons to it and and it just two to three hundred dollar ball game that you're not going to see for three or two to three years uh, no <laughs> so there's that good grief uh, what is on kickstarter at the moment which is kind of cool is the expansion of the village attacks um which we uh reviewed about a year ago uh it's a tower defense game with a kind of cool idea is that you are the monsters in the transylvanian tower um, and all the villagers as the name would suggest are attacking the castle and you are trying to defend the castle heart um, from the thing. It's kind of cool, it's really cool, with really nice miniatures, really kind of aesthetic, really good idea, really good nice theming of that game. Um, so we enjoyed that one. Um, I can give it 8 out of 10. Uh, so there's an expansion um, for it, which adds some more monsters, some more castle tiles, more stuff. Um, it's doing very well at the moment. Um, that was from Grimlord Games. So maybe take a look at that. Uh, and I think that is all of the uh, Kickstarter -y shenanigans that we want to discuss at this point. There's probably some other stuff out there. I can't keep up with it. I don't know. Um, so yes, we've covered Omens coming out. Um, Zuma and Omens, we've covered the review of that's happened. Uh, there's a, as I've already teased, there is a top 10 Halloween uh, ball games coming. Where we, hopefully I'll be filming that uh, next couple of days. Um, that should drop next week. If I get time, yay! Uh, and that's it. Anything else on my horizon? I'm, there is something else coming up. I'm going to do uh, a bit of a Martin Wallace look. Look at some Martin Wallace's games because we've played quite a chunk of them. I've, I'm aware that I've got a few of them. So I thought we'd do a little of a, a Martin Wallace thing, um, which I'm working on at the moment. I haven't done that yet, but that's another tease. Basically, this entire episode is a giant cock tease for stuff that we're going to do later on. So it's the equivalent of gaming blue balls that you'll be getting from the joy of what i'm giving you other than that obviously next week sees essen happening which we're not going to essen so fuck that we're not interested in the slightest of that what's the point stuff will come out later that we'll look at but yes everyone will be talking essen everyone will get excited about essen i'm sure if you're in any facebook group or twitter or anywhere you will not miss you will not miss any of the latest news from essen um so keep an eye on the world and you'll probably find out some stuff from that um yes that's about it i may have been might be this has been <laughs> a, a, a ranty uh, uh who does Wells tv um i will be back again to say next week we'll do some more stuff but there's not much going on basically we've got lots of stuff that we're doing and none of it we've done so there we go that is the latest news um, from us have a lovely weekend um, hopefully i get this entity before the weekend in which case if i haven't then i hope the weekend was lovely um, and mine was probably also gorgeous um and this has come out i'm raving like a lunatic um so there we go yes that's it i've got nothing else to add really play some games the weekend enjoy yourselves it's friday um i'm going out to play some games tonight got some stuff to do there there's that thank you and good night until next time which will probably be next week we will meet up then yes